Hi everyone, this is Kerem speaking and I'm running Tech Journal, which is covering global tech startup and sustainability stories. This is my new format which is called In Short and I handle top 3 tech stories of the week. And before starting the video, I will have a request from you. I'll be happy if you subscribe to my channel. Ok now let's get back to the video. Uh, my first story is coming from Amazon and Amazon will be investing in uh, Anthropic which is a generative AI startup is, uh, based in San Francisco and it was founded in 2021. And here are some details about the deal. And as a part of the agreement uh, contract, I mean, Amazon will be uh, buying a minority share uh, of the company and has agreed to incorporate Anthropic's uh, technology into uh, various products across its business line, including the Amazon Bedrock service for uh, building AI applications. And Anthropic will also use Amazon's custom chips to build, train, and uh, deploy its future uh, AI uh, foundation models uh, mo models in addition Amazon web services uh, Amazon web services will become Anthropic's main cloud supplier according to Reuters uh, Amazon has uh, initially committed to uh, 1.25 uh, billion dollars uh, investment with an uh, alt alternative to grow the investment another 2.75 billion dollars if the deal reaches uh, the real uh, the reaches uh, 4 billion dollars in total bloomberg reports that, uh, that this will represent the largest known investment ever related to aws as a side note aws is currently the the world's largest seller of on-demand computing power and data storage and uh, let me add that google also has an interest in Anthropic with a uh, roughly 10% stake after uh, making a 300 million dollars investment in the AI startup earlier this year. And my second story is coming from Thailand and uh, Thailand's Prime Minister uh, Sreta Tavisin said that the country expected to receive uh, investment of five, at least 5 billion dollars from Tesla, Google and Microsoft. I saw this story at Reuters and uh, Tavisin commented as follows. Tesla would be, be looking into an EV manufacturing facility. Microsoft and Google are looking at data centers. But he didn't provide any details uh, whether the $5 billion was expected to be a combined investment or made individually by each company. Uh, the Thai Prime Minister held talks uh, various companies at UN uh, General Assembly last week at New in New York, uh, but those uh, three companies didn't respond to request for comment. Uh, let me note that uh, Thailand is Asia's fourth largest uh, automobile uh, assembly hub and has been uh, offering incentives to EV and battery makers and uh, tax cuts to local EV buyers to remain a regional auto center. And my third and final story is coming from uh, Getty Images and uh, the company introduced an AI uh, tool that can generate pictures based on user prompts. The new tool is called the Generative AI uh, by Getty and it also set out a payment plan for those who, whose images were used to train the AI system. Getty's latest product, developed in partnership with chip company NVIDIA, uh, was trained uh, in its own large uh, library of images. All content generated uh, using uh, this is AI will belong to the customer and not be added into Getty's uh, existing uh, content libraries uh, for others uh, for others to license. Uh, let me note that the US uh, photo agency is one of the world's largest uh, uh, photo libraries with more than uh, 477 million uh, copyrighted images in its archives. Uh, this is all from Tech Journal and in short, I hope this video has been informative to you. If yes, please remember to subscribe to my channel, like my videos and post your comments below. Also turn on notifications to hear about the latest videos. Thank you for your time and see you soon with the videos and bye for now.